part of cosmos really annoys me dot dot slash dot dot slash dot dot slash so by now most of you would have heard this name cosmos it's the design system that i work on and this is the folder structure of it so inside our source directory we have these two things which are related which is components and tokens so tokens are these kind of variable files which hold all of the design decisions for example it holds what is the primary button background that decision is here and then components use it for example my header component imports colors and fonts from tokens and uses these in the styles so because of the way it's structured one part of cosmos really annoys me which is these relative path right for each component i have to do this dot dot slash dot dot slash dot dot slash and if i change the structure which i had to more than once i have to redo all of these dot dot things i'm sure many of you have experienced this so i'll not try to explain the problem too much the solution is well there are multiple solutions but the one i really like is using yarn workspaces and this is kind of how it goes so for your repository which holds all of this you need a package json and in that you need to set private is true because you don't want to publish this whole thing you want to publish components and tokens as individual packages and then you declare workspaces and you drop the directory so it's going to be source components and source tokens for me these are the two and for each of these to qualify as a package they need to have a package.json in them so first let's start with tokens i'm going to create a new file package.json and this is auth0/cosmos tokens so this is my first package and then inside components i'm going to create another package.json and call it odd zero slash cosmos so this is my root this is where i start things and this is the one that uses tokens so i'm going to drop odd zero cosmos tokens as a dependency and next what i'm going to do is i'm going to run yarn install in the repository and what this does is even though those packages don't really exist yet it will treat them as it does and link them together So this is done, and now in my component, I can replace this by odd zero slash cosmos tokens, and it works. This gives us two benefits. The first one is that I don't have to do the dot dot nonsense. The other benefit of this is I can make changes to a package like tokens and test it with packages that depend on it on my local machine before publishing things, and that's incredibly helpful. All right, thanks for watching a shorter episode of my daily clock. I make these every day. I try to teach something that I have learned and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.